Every idea has the potential to become a great one, but isn't it difficult to know how to bring it to life? Once you have a project in mind, it can be daunting to know where to start. Even once you've started, you can easily get stuck or unsure about what to do next. To be really successful, it is important to understand and plan the right strategy. But how do you build a clear picture of your innovation process? The innovation flowchart is a great tool to lead you through each stage of the process. It gives you a detailed overview of all the possible steps and considerations you will need to make and the activities, requirements and goals of each stage. The flowchart helps you to check where you are currently, what you need to do next and plan for potential opportunities. Jennifer and Matthew have an idea to start a social venture that will tackle the issue of malnutrition in pregnant women. They are committed to finding an innovative way to break the destructive global cycle of anemia among pregnant women and their children. It's a big ambition and they know that they need to think about the many different aspects for the idea to be a success. They use the innovation flowchart to think through all the stages of their initiative. They begin by reviewing the things that they have already done to identify where they are in the process. Jennifer and Matthew have completed their early research and need to begin making sense of it to generate viable ideas. They begin by capturing their findings in exploring opportunities and challenges. The research they conducted, the practical tools they used to support their research, the level of risk and how they plan to overcome it, the finance they need, the insights they have collected from their research, and the root problem that they want to focus on. Jennifer and Matthew can now use all of this information to generate ideas. They allocate time for ideas generation and the facilitation support that it will need. They select the tools they will use to support this work and plan to produce a theory of change. What evidence and measures will they need to be clear about? They hope that this process will help them to improve their initial idea. The next step will be for Jennifer and Matthew to test their idea and they review the worksheet to make notes about the people, skills, activities and finances that will be required for each stage of their journey. Though they have a long way to go, the innovation flowchart guides Jennifer and Matthew through the many aspects of their work. And after a couple of years, Jennifer and Matthew's idea has grown into a fortified cookie to improve iron and nutritional intake for pregnant women. The cookie has significantly improved the health of women and their children. It has been adopted widely and using the innovation flowchart, Jennifer and Matthew have been able to plan the different elements needed to introduce the initiative to other countries.